Okay, here's my lot on eBay. And as for eBay rules about 12 pictures, I thought I would do um, a video to show exactly what you would get as this bundle of uh, veneer is from a marketry slash um, furniture restoration. Um, I have absolutely loads of it and this is going to be bundle one. And as you know, veneer, good quality veneer can be quite expensive. So I thought I'd do a video to show you exactly what you'll be getting. As you can see, average length of a kitchen worktop, so I'll give you average size. That's piece one. Piece two. That one is. There's some rare species here. There's a lot of um, burr as well, and some nice patterns. This one's a nice piece. Some other head and egg, and coloured. These uh, looks like they've been used for marketry, these two. There's some in sequence, this lot here are all cut in sequence. You can see. These ones are absolutely beautiful. Some of these are 50, 60 years old. This one's quite a big piece. And there's another one in a sequence. There's another one in a sequence. Uh, there's another one. Let's see, they're quite big. Some of these are a good 18 inches by 10 inches. That's the unusual one. They're all different ones, I can't remember them all. To be honest, is uh, two bookmatch ones here again. That one and that one are both bookmatched. It's a nice piece, nice pearl. Very heavy. There is three pieces there. And one, two, and three. There's another piece of that one, book match from earlier. There's another piece. And this piece is a brown one. And that's glue back, that one is. That's maple, I think. Mahogany. and book matched as well. These two are book matched. This one and this one. This is um, mahogany. Quite a big piece. Used a bit of this to prepare some units in the past. Here's bird's eye. This bird's eye maple. You can see the birds are in it. Some U. Three pieces, I think. A piece of maple. Someone's got the uh, tiger, tiger effect. A big piece. Unfortunately, it's split, but we'll glue back down. There's another piece. Bird's eye as well. Quite a bit of mahogany. Much 
pieces there, and another piece here on the book match. Excuse the dog. Shame more behind it. And some redwood, walnut, sorry. Typical walnut. Big piece there, and this one is the positive response. It is paperbacked, as you can see, and it's about 1.5 mil thick. And that piece is absolutely beautiful. Okay, that's the pile of big ones. Let's move that on one side. Then you got the pile of smaller ones. These are all exotics. Well, a lot of them are like exotics, should I say? Marketry. This one is Mungina, never heard of it. Last year Mungina, European walnut. My uncle did put stickers on this to, um, to identify them because there's a lot of rare pieces in here. You can cut directly a slab. Another piece of that one. I'll say there's something cut up, but there's that much here, massive lot. It's nearly five kilos, I think, if I remember right. Uh, I will wait and put it in the description. That must be new some marketry. Pieces of brown now. I'll see how this lot goes and then I'll put the rest on because I've got a lot more um, half, a, half a crate full, it's massive. That one's quite thick. Australian walnut. These few here are book matched. There's two, three, four, five, six, I think. There. Another piece. And another piece. Another piece. And another cut off piece of that amazing burr walnut that's on the other pile. Okay, that's pile two. And then pile three are these slim pieces or off cuts. That's been cut off and it's too good to throw away. As you can see, there's another piece of that burl. Some pieces may not be any good to anybody, but there you are. Some nice pieces of brown up. of book match there as four beautiful piece of ebony nice piece there we go thank you for watching that's all what you'll be getting lot and more lot one as you can see there's a hell of a lot and I think, like I said before, I think there's about 5 kilos, but I will measure it all up. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.